Hello everyone, my name is Draconic Rose and welcome back to another episode of RimWorld. Last we had left off, we had just had a raid from Fort Tribals and they left us a mess to clean up, which we are doing right now. We also dealing with toxic fallout, which is particularly bad for this colony type. Uh, but especially for our animals and food supply. Now, I want this harvested before the toxic fallout like really messes with all the plants. Uh, sorry about this, just checking. Yep. Yeah. Uh, sometimes when I play this on my own, I turn off the music and I never really remember if I turned it back on. Um, so let's see. Uh, I don't think we have any agave around. And no wildlife. So we're definitely going to have to look for corpses. There are none. There's some mush. Uh, I see an agave. Good. We'll harvest it. Like, we really don't have a choice here. We will have to go to the end of the map, like, looking for food. Because this toxic fallout is really going to wreck us. Like, really, really badly. Mm, yeah. We'll probably have to eat some animals. Probably a dog. We'll see. Uh, so we had our workshop getting done and I had comments praising the floor. Thank you very much. Now we need to keep an eye on people's health minor, so definitely want to restrict you. Ooh, moderate. Initial, moderate, nope, minor, and minor, and moderate. Eee. People are not doing well. But as you can see, the restrictions make sure that they uh, keep using the, the paths I have for them. Let's see. What do we have as a fallout area? I need to add this one. And possibly build a little roof area around here. There we go. And we'll add fallout areas here. So that people will use these paths. Uh, here, there. Now, thank, hope, uh, not thankfully, hopefully, people will recover. Tillage. Very good. We needed that because now we can plow all that rich soil and get ourselves more food growth. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, what can we have? Hmm. Well, we definitely want hydroponics as soon as possible. Tattered apparel. What is actually. This makes it easier. Uh, the armor vest. Nothing I can do about that. Minor break with supplies. Starving. Sick. Shared better. My yeah, I know. I'm sorry, Pigawar, things aren't really going well. All our dogs are female, so... Mm. Uh, well, stone-faced. I'm sorry, Popper. You don't have to see that. And now we have some more food, unfortunately. And please, please, please get those gathered. Let's make another round. Minor, moderate, 
minor. Ooh, no, it's moderate. Yeah, go back inside. Unfortunately, Pigalar. That is not an allowed area. a little bit more of roof there, got an eclipse. Yes, I know everyone is idle. Why are they not using the allowed areas sometimes? This is entirely odd. Must be because of the pathfinding mod I have. That's okay, I guess. Unfortunately, <laughs> this does not make for good viewing. Oops. Mm. The animals are starving as well. Though I do have some hay. I don't know if dogs can eat hay, can they? Diet, vegetables, raw meat, corpses, seeds. Pff, no idea. Probably not. And the kitty? Uh, definitely not. So, we can't afford to keep the dogs. And Morgan John is having a mental break. Because we really need the food. And hiding in his room, just... Nope. Chris and help out, thank you. Do you have all of the... Do you have all of the storage in the fallout area, so that helps. Mm. I don't know cat needs food uh, oh this this isn't good I'm going to have to unrestrict them on minor and keep them restricted on moderate unfortunately. As that might help out. Nardo, why were you? <sighs> okay, okay, my fault. N not. I suppose you only need to be allowed on the inside of that. Uh, for the people I do need to allow the walls because if it's needed for repair then they can repair it. Minor, minor, moderate, moderate. Minor, minor, severe illness, Jessamine, what is your thing? Extreme malnutrition. Well, on the bright side, if you die, we, um, we get to eat you. Uh, war. Or Morgan John. Actually, Pigalar. Come. What are you doing? Why can't I tell you to 
kill that puppy. Yeah. Please prioritize slaughtering before we Okay. Okay, Kristen Butcher. No. Butcher. No. No. Cook. Uh. Okay, Nardo is still good. I think she got some food. Let's see. Yes, she did. That is nice. Kristen Minor. Minor. Moderate. Moderate. Minor. Minor. And moderate. And serious. Oh, jeez, fourth drop. Go, go get something. Yes, I know things aren't things aren't good right now. <laughs> Let's put this as medical. So that if people need the second rescue or something. But they guess they'll decide to go on the binge and sleep. So there's that. And I think I forgot my timer again. Yes, I did. No problem. Oh no, Jess! Kristen! Rescue! Cargo pods, please be food. Yes. Food! Food! Come to us, food. It's not a lot, but it is food. Ah, delicious, delicious food. It's, and I know this is probably boring, but it's quite necessary. The likelihood of us being attacked is pretty low. Really? Camel hair? Well, it's staying out there for now. I'm not sending my people that far. There's, of course, no wildlife. And the toxic fallout keeps killing plants, so... I definitely have to stay on top of harvest. Nothing to hunt anyway, so yeah. Okay, hopefully people are doing okay. And also hopefully we'll come out of this without anyone dying. So that's definitely the main thing. Good Morgan John doing a decent job. Everybody, oh, well, 
almost everybody is needing a break from the fallout. Roof now. Or, well, it will be eventually. Uh, minor. So, this is what you do when you have nothing to do. And I guess I could do the same here. Just trying to keep people under a roof. Have no real reason to go there usually. This one actually doesn't get to the roof. This one can't have a roof there because... Well, it can't. Else we'd have no power being built there. And you're minor, minor. And moderate and minor. Moderate and moderate. Mm. Let's see, more cargo pods. No, we have drugs. Well, actually, no. Keep your drugs to yourselves. I really just want you to harvest as much food as possible. Mm, I guess we're getting... Muffalo Leather Duster. That's nice and fine. Uh, I could really use this toxic fallout disappearing. To be perfectly honest, and I'll disallow sewing there. People are working. Garrett, I'd really prefer it if we yeah, do that. if no one dies of hunger. Good job, big war. is at least some fruit coming in. I'm really sorry, I don't really know what to comment here. Uh, things are very, very bad. There's a lot of wait and see going on here. At least we're getting our hydroponics slowly researched. That will be good. I'll probably temporarily set them up wherever just so we have mm. wow just so you have them going Kristen moderate build up also moderate 
Unfortunately... So we keep stop hitting the smoke leaf while you have toxic buildup. Oh. Our power had issues. Oh, because of the zit event. That's fine. Severe illness on Morgan John. Extreme malnutrition. Yep, that happened. Um, orders, H4 harvest. Please harvest all of that. Jess has a major break risk. Well. Anyone who's unrestricted. Morgan John cannot walk. Well, oh dear. Kristen's a minor. So, Kristen, I'm sorry, but it falls to you. Please go feed Morgan John. Okay, that was just a little bit of food. Like, really just a little bit. Uh, plant cutting is a really high priority. Sandra, please, we do need more food. Mm, these are desiccated. Well, that's herbal medicine. Wait. Are we feeding Croyo? No. Absolutely not. Jess has died because of malnutrition. That sucks. Butcher. Any particular reason? Mm. Oh, I definitely have materials. Oh, these. Fine, eat her raw. Can you feed, please? Oh, you're already doing that. Thank you. I'm sorry, Jess, but you will help this colony survive another day. 
since apparently your corpse like it fed a lot of people. It sure did. And also on the bright side, oh, we have another one. Sorry, Kroyo, you are also going to feed a lot of people. Please, please, please. Please cook. Mmm, cannibalism. Uh, yes. This is life now. Again. <laughs> I'm so sorry, everyone. Ugh. We must attempt to keep food coming. Nobody likes cannibalism. Who has an extreme break risk? Morgan, you have a dead man's armor vest. And you don't like that people died and that you had to eat people. Not much I can do. I mean, I can take out the armor vest. That should help. But hey, Gazilla, do you have something I can do? Uh, yes, I could give you a less impressive bedroom. However, since you want to be Blades Lover, not gonna happen. Yeah, mostly people are pissed we don't have food. Uh, need food, butcher it, slip, disturbed, sick, and pain. Mm. No, not much I can do. There's food. Please go get it. Someone who isn't restricted, please haul that food inside. Wanderer joins. Awesome. Oh, and she has a gas mask. Well, that will probably make things better for us now. Uh, you are definitely going to do growing and cutting as a first. Nope. Also hauling and cleaning. Ordening, yeah. You can mine and repair. And yeah. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And since I already had some names picked out, let's see here. Riggs' real name is actually Taters. Taters uh, is a friend and a commenter. 
and you should see her channel showing up right about now-ish. Rock cannibalism for mental breaks, yes. Wandering in the days is really not ideal. Like, not at all. And Blade has a cancer. Beautiful. I guess I can remove it as soon as I get... Um, some Glitter World Medicine? Well, ah, just forgot what the name of it was. So, for now, let's let Taters have that bath. And since Taters has a gas mask, this definitely means that she will... Uh, do our um, farming for us, Jace. Okay, so let's put her and Pigawar in the normal schedule. And with that... Oh! We had a psychic sooth. Only for the males, but that definitely will help with the moods. So, with that, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please subscribe to so you can see when I post more. Alright, bye!